A ganglion cyst is a fluid-filled lump that commonly develops along the tendons or joints of the wrists or hands. Typically, a ganglion cyst presents as a visible lump that's soft to the touch and can change in size. It can increase size over time or opposite decrease. Rarely it can cause pressure on the affected area nerve and cause pain or discomfort. Most ganglion cyst will resolve itself within few years. Most frequently, a ganglion cyst appears on the back of the wrist. Yet, it can also be found on the palm side of the wrist, on the hand, or even sometimes on the foot. Given that the ganglion cyst is the most prevalent mass found in the hands and wrists, it's viewed as a common condition. It predominantly affects women, with about 70% of cases being reported among them. The age group most frequently affected ranges from 20 to 40 years. The exact cause of the ganglion cyst remains uncertain. However, it's believed to be associated with trauma, repetitive movement, irritation, and osteoarthritis. The tissue surrounding the joint bulges and fills with a thick, lubricating fluid similar to that found within our joints. Diagnosis is primarily clinical, but gold standard of diagnosis is MRI. Ultrasound is cost-effective alternative. It's important to note that ganglion cysts are benign, meaning they are not cancerous nor do they evolve into cancer. The majority, ranging from 50% to 58%, naturally resolve without any intervention over a span of a few years. Still, post-treatment recurrence can vary, with rates hovering between 12% to 40%. Commonly, the initial approach is observational. However, if the cyst triggers noticeable symptoms, surgical intervention becomes a recommended course of action. Surgical excision of the cyst is contemplated if other treatments prove ineffective or if the cyst severely hampers the patient's quality of life. Alternatively, doctors might opt to aspirate the cyst, draining the fluid, followed by an injection of anti-inflammatory medication like corticosteroids. It's noteworthy that recurrence post-aspiration is more frequent than after surgical removal.